Hello everyone, welcome to the video on the concept of ABO blood grouping. First understand this thing. Human red blood cell contains antigens. Antigen A, antigen B or antigen AB. Based on the presence of these antigens, their blood type is grouped. Like type A blood has got antigen A on its red blood cell. Whereas type B blood group has got antigen B on its red blood cells. AB has got antigen A as well as antigen B present on the red blood cell. Whereas type O do not have any antigens on the red blood cell. So the blood grouping is based on antigens that are present on red blood cells. Blood plasma contains antibodies. They are also known as agglutinogens. So type A blood plasma has got anti B antibody. Understand this. Type A means the RBC has got antigen A. Plasma has got anti B antibody. Type B antigen on the red blood cell is B antigen whereas plasma contains anti A antibody. Type AB it has got both antigens on the red blood cell so it do not contain any antibodies in its plasma. Whereas type O no antigens are present on the red blood cell so the, the plasma contains both anti A as well as anti B antibodies. So usually the blood transfusion reaction occurs when a different type of blood is transfused. Donor recipient is there. Let's say I am blood A type recipient and I am taking blood A, nothing happens. If I take type B blood, see my blood plasma contains anti B antibodies. They will interact with antigens present on the red blood RBC of donor's blood. So there occurs antigen antibody reaction, it forms an immune complex, hemolysis occurs and that hemolysis releases certain chemicals which results in reactions that is what is called as incompatibility, major incompatibility. Now again understand the recipient plasma antibodies will exert a major incompatibility reaction with donor's RBC. Now, donor's blood also contains antibodies, but they will be diluted in recipient blood. So, that antibodies do not have any effect. Donor's antigen is what reacts with the recipient's antibodies. So, this is what is ABO type of blood grouping is. Again, positive negative factors are there. There is an another protein called as rhesus protein, RH protein. If that protein is present on the RBC, they are called as positive. If the protein is not there, they are called as RH negative. Thank you for watching this video.